Devils, what the hell is happening? I thought that we already figured things out in game three. 8-4 victory, but nope, we're back to how it used to be. Another win here for the Carolina Hurricanes, and that puts them 3-1 on the Devils, putting them right up against the fence in game five, which I believe is going to be on Thursday. But regardless, man, this New Jersey Devils team is an absolute embarrassment. It was 1-1 heading into the second period, and then everything just hit the fan. They scored five unanswered goals in that second period to make it 6-1. And then after that, I just turned off the game because I knew there was no possible way. Also, man, Vitek Vanacek, that guy is a fraud, man. What is with goalies? that play well in the regular season, and then when it comes to the playoffs, they're just a different person. We saw this unfold with Linus Allmark, and although Allmark was reportedly injured, I'm not buying it, man. The guy still was terrible, and he was still willingly going in the net, even though there was a top 10 goaltender in Jeremy Swayman who was just sitting cold on the bench. You know, you have this other guy, Kira Schmidt. He comes in and does his best Captain America impression as he single-handedly pulls the Devils out of the depths of hell and springs them through to the second round somehow. I'm still convinced to this day that if it weren't for Akira Schmidt and the form that he was somehow maintaining, there was no way they'd get by that first round against the Rangers. I just don't see it. His playing really blocked out the noise of a lot of the other problems that the Devils were facing at the time. And it made people think like everything was okay because we just couldn't see it. It made it seem like the Devils were winning the 200-foot battle against the Rangers when in actuality, their goaltender was just playing nuts and they had a couple lucky breaks. I mean, look what happened last game. You win 8-4. to four. Yeah, you scored 8 goals, but you still let in 4. You know, I don't think there's a game in this series where the Devils haven't let in more than 4 goals. And you look at back in the first round, Game 1 and Game 2. They lost 5-1 in both of those as well. So you see what I mean? Like this team, when they don't have goaltending, are terrible. They're so bad. They're getting exposed for it. And I'm confident in saying that there's no way that the Devils can get back in this series. There's just no way. I don't see it. Like, let me know in the comment section below for if you think the Devils can somehow pull their way back into this series and win it in seven now that they're down three to one. Who knows what's going to happen? I mean, I've been wrong about stuff like this before. And hey, I thought that the Bruins were going to be through after game five. But look what happened there. But I don't know. I feel like the Hurricanes are just so on the ball right now. They're going to make the finals. And they really have a shot at winning the Stanley Cup. Let me know what you guys think. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Like the video if you're new around here. Because man, we're out here posting consistently. Trying to get that 4K. Which I'm confident that we're going to get by the end of these playoffs. I'm sure of it. And yeah, man. I'll be sure to catch you guys all in the next one. Peace out and take care.